Here is my arpeggio. And it sounds kind of static and boring. Uh, and sometimes it will work, but today we're going to be making it a little bit more appealing to the ear. And I'm going to do that by making some interesting stuff with velocity here. As you can see, it's the same value over the whole MIDI pattern. Let's draw our own volume here. It will be something like waves. So it goes down and up over the time. And let's assign this to our filter, for example. Let's change it a little bit so that we, we can hear it clearly. And we can add some random mice function to this just a little bit. And this is not the only thing that we can do. We can also, for example, turn on the second waveform. And assign velocity to its volume. So as you can see, this waveform becomes louder every now and then. And let's go further and assign something really crazy to this. For example, this FM knob in the second oscillator. And as you can see, it gives us really interesting results. And now it sounds more like gated chords or something, but I don't need that here, but you can use it in your own productions. So let's listen before and after. For this, I will disable, disconnect all things in this synth. This is after, and this is what we had before. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you found this useful, and see you in the next video.